This week I have not one but two wines of the week because both wines were pitched as being the perfect wines to match with chocolate, particularly in the run up to Easter Sunday uh, at the end of this month when um, many people will consume one of those lovely chocolate eggs. And in fact, both bottles arrived on my desk with a little bar of 70% cocoa solids chocolate with the suggestion that these were the perfect chocolate matches. What's interesting about them is the two wines could not be more different. I did taste them with chocolate. They both worked very well as chocolate matching wines. So I thought it was worth including both as my wines of the week. Wine number one um, comes from South Africa and it's part of a whole new kind of uh, genre of wines um, with cafe and coffee and chocolate names in their title. We, you know, we've had cappuccino pinotages and we've had espresso siras and all sorts of stuff. This one is the Cafe Cabernet made in South Africa, selling for £8.99 through thedrinkshop.com and um, the wine has been chosen specifically this rich berry Cabernet Sauvignon and aged and very carefully chosen French and American oak barrels which have the right level of toastiness to give those kind of cappuccino coffee mocha notes which the winemaker thinks will match very well with chocolate. What I like about this wine, as opposed to some of the other wines of this style that have come out, is that it is not overdone. On the nose, yes, there's a kind of ground coffee, very dark, bitter chocolate note there, but there's not the kind of high toast, overwhelming coffee aroma that some of the more clumsy examples have had. And beneath it, there is a very dry, dark, black currant, cassis kind of fruit quality. On the palate, it has plenty of that darkness, that toast, that mocha coffee and espresso edge to it. But there's a nice, firm, juicy core of fruit in there too. And the wine, in fact, is a big, um, I think it's 14%, 13.5% alcohol, but a big, round, powerful mouthful of Cabernet Sauvignon with that extra layering of that kind of toasty coffee quality to it. It does match very well with dark chocolate. It emphasises the fruity tones in the wine when you have it with a little nibble of a nice uh, bittersweet dark chocolate. So it's successful in what it does. It's a good wine. Um, it's not as overblown as some. And it is the Café Cabernet from South Africa, selling for £8.99 in thedrinkshop.com and it comes from the 2011 vintage and from vineyards in the Parle area of South Africa. The second wine is also pitched as going extremely well with chocolate, but it's a whole different kettle of fish. It's a Madeira, a fortified wine, and it's not been manufactured specifically to go with coffee or to pronounce those elements. It's just that it's a style of wine that does that rather well. This is the Blandi's Alvada, five-year-old Madeira. It sells for around £13 in Waitrose, Booths and Harrods. And it's a blend of two of the very traditional fine Madeira grapes. Uh, Malmsey and Bual. You can see it has this lovely um, tawny colour, lovely rich tawny colour, five years in American oak barrels in the lofts in Madeira where the gentle heat oxidises the wines and ages them. And on the nose, a oh, delicious walnut, lovely walnut fig, lovely marmalade orange, Seville oranges, a hint of stewed tea, all the classic Madeira notes, which are really, really delicious. And on the palate, gorgeous. It's sumptuous. It has the sweetness. It has that weight of raisin, plum, walnut. But it's quite dry and fine in the finish too. Although there's a lot of sweetness in the mid palate, it finishes quite dry, a tangy lemon and orange bite coming through to make it not tiring to drink, very refreshing. 
lovely aperitif wine I think um, very nice with certain desserts and indeed another one that matched beautifully with the chocolate um, in this case the chocolate made it much more sumptuous in the mouth but it even richer and it uh, matched extremely well uh, this is the Blandi's Alvada five-year-old Madeira it's on sale in Waitrose, Booths and Harrods for around about £13. Two chocolate wines. Uh, couldn't be more contrasting. You might like one more than the other. You might not fancy the style of Madeira. You might not fancy the confected idea of making this chocolate style wine from South Africa. But both interesting choices and both do work with chocolate. My Wines of the Week. <laughs>